It took a lot of hard shit just to learn how not to break down and stop, babe No matter what I've seen in the past, I want that it impact, I'll be grown out, baby You can't let it slip away, a drift away, can go to waste, go to waste, uh -huh. I say it's strange, they say it pays, won't contemplate, you got to play that, babe I don't wanna wait another minute for you I know you got me falling from the ceiling for you Then you went from the sun, there was no limit to you And I'm catching feelings, baby Hello stranger, it's been a minute since we last kicked it And by the way, just got it Hello guys, welcome back to another vlog This vlog is Major's birthday vlog, so um, birthday party vlog. So in the previous vlog, you saw what we actually did on his actual birthday. Took him to build a bear, all those fun stuff. So go check out that video if you guys haven't already. Um, also, if you guys are new here, my name is Tasha. I make motherhood and lifestyle content here on my channel, as well as TikTok, Instagram, all that good stuff. So go follow me on all my social media networks. But anyway, so today is Major's birthday party. It is August 31st, 2024. He is turning one or he has turned one he's officially one whatever you may call it say it whatever um so yeah um honestly right now i've already done technically our morning routine i read my bible did my you know did my devotional worshiped all that kind of stuff prayed and then changed the boys diapers right now they're all eating and then also i don't even think i've made a life update video i think it was supposed to come out either before this vlog or after this vlog. I don't know how I'm going to do it. But anyway, let me just update y'all right now because why not? So, <laughs> um, I'm just going to like, un I don't know how I wanted to do it because I kind of want to do like a separate like pregnancy video. So, um, <laughs> so yeah, I think the pregnancy video should have came out before this vlog, if I'm not mistaken. But if it hasn't already, let me just re-announce or announce again officially. I am pregnant with baby number three. And also, we are now staying at my parents' house. So, um, just staying at my parents' house just for a couple of months to basically pay off debt and then, you know, get a house. So, that is basically our plan because living in apartments with three kids is just not, like, my ideal situation um with two kids it was not bad but even then it was stressing me out with the parking and like legging them up and down like the the elevator and stuff like that i'm just like i can't wait to get my own garage and like have my more space for them and have a backyard for them like all that good stuff so yeah we're staying at my parents for a couple of months so that is a big update those are two big updates so i will be making like probably an additional update video later on so if you guys have any specific questions please leave them in, in the comments and i will answer them in that video but yeah anyway since I just caught y'all up with basically what is going on currently um yeah so right now my husband went out to go get his haircut he should be on his way back now as I told you guys the boys have our have are currently eating right now um and what else yeah so just take you guys along this whole birthday vlog hopefully you guys enjoy this please don't forget to give this a thumbs up if you guys would like to see content like that if you guys ever would like to see like an updated morning routine like in my parents house or updated night routine let me know in the comments i do have a whole bunch of morning routine or day in the live type of videos on my channel so if you guys haven't already go check those out um but yeah so i'm about to be a mom of three um also I didn't even announce the gender, but it's a boy, so I think I've kind of already said that in some of my other vlogs, but I don't know, y'all, mom brain, pregnancy brain, all of it, brain, okay, so I'm having another boy, so I'm still a boy mom, intact, I really wanted a girl, but I'll discuss that in a life update video about like gender discipline and all that kind of good stuff, <sighs> I don't know if that's good stuff, but anyway, <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'll see you guys when we are starting to get ready for the party, bye. All right, y'all, so this is what the birthday boy's gonna wear. Um, got this outfit from Amazon. It is super cute. I like the little, what's it called, detail right here that says Mr. One, Durful. Um, got these suspenders, I think that's what they're called. 
And then this little hat that says one on it. So that's what baby boy is going to wear. And then this is just some stuff that I got from Walmart. So just like hygiene products and stuff. I think I might do a haul for y'all. And then got their hair stuff out. Lotion. This is the lotion that they use. So, yeah. And then for Big Brother, he's going to wear his Spider-Man outfit. He hasn't worn this outfit. He's had this outfit for months now. But he has never worn this outfit. So I was like, this outfit seems perfect. And also, it's blue. And Big Boy's outfit is blue. So it kind of, like, works out with the coordination. I'm just going to wear this orange jumpsuit because I don't have anything blue to wear. So I was like, let me just do orange. Um, kind of might go with the, with the theme. Orange and blue kind of go together. So orange, blue, and red kind of look decent together so that is my outfit i already got it laid out so let me show you guys this haul all right guys so let me show you guys a quick little haul so i got this this is the deodorant i'm gonna start using honestly y'all the women deodorant do not be holding as strong as the men deodorant it's so much stronger plus i like the spray on i don't know what it is about the roll-on ones they're starting to like break me out but when i use spray it doesn't break me out so i got this um Got some hair care products so these are for the boys i'm trying out the dove one like the dove baby hair care line that they kind of have um from the hair love film you know something about representation gets my heart happy so i got the conditioner and the shampoo conditioner should be on its way but i do have the shampoo right here got me also some hair care products so eco styler gel for me when i want to slick back my hair got me some hannah sanitizer because you can never have too much of that i actually wanted the travel size because i wanted the travel size the one that goes into my bag but they gave me the big one so i don't know what i'm gonna do with that um but hey now i have hand sanitizer probably keep it in the room got me also some makeup products so this is like setting spray that i'm gonna test out because my setting spray is like starting to run out also got me a primer from the same brand it's called hard candy that's the brand got me some lip balm because i do want to put one lip balm on my little nightstand that i got going on here got a travel size <laughs> uh deodorant because you know can never be too you know cautious and that's just for when i travel this one's just actually for my travel bag i do have another one of these for the one for the bags like my casual bag that i wear out all the time so now i have one so next time i travel i have it so uh, one less thing to buy i got these toothbrush holders for the kids toothbrush um i also got me some lip liner and this is from hard candy as well the brand i got the mauve color some hair care products right here so i got the shea moisture conditioner and the shampoo i'm gonna try that on my hair i don't think i've tried i've tried shea moisture before but i haven't tried like the actual that type then i got the carol's daughter like this is for my scalp hair oil needed some so got that and then i think i forgot to take this off but i also got the women's deodorant so now i guess when this runs out and i don't have don't have anything else i'll just use this one this will just be my backup but yeah that's a little haul for y'all that's all i got you know hygiene wise um but yeah i have more hygiene stuff coming in honestly i kind of did like a big haul this paycheck um so i don't have to do that um for a while so yeah anyway <sighs> let me go chill for a little bit because i'm not going to get the kids ready for another hour so yeah all right y'all so i've already gotten the kids ready so for the most part so we did bath them and by we i mean they were sister we bathed the kids she bathed major i bathed micah um that's one perk of moving back home is the extended help with family members so it's been super nice giving me and malik a break sometimes so that's always great so anyway so the kids are bathed lotioned up all that good stuff um only thing we haven't done is did their hair and brush their teeth so when they wake up from their nap we're gonna just do all that and then put on their outfits that they're gonna wear at night i mean for the party and stuff like that um so yeah so and honestly, if you guys are parents of toddlers or parents of, like, little children, y'all know they need to get a nap in. Like, if they don't get a nap in, they're going to be cranky, and it's not going to be a good thing. So, 
Um, right now it's like 11.50 something, um, so they should at least get like an hour or two of a nap, which works out perfect because I have a wax appointment at 1.45. So my plan is to start getting ready probably around, I don't know, probably around 12.30, um, start getting ready and stuff, um, put on an outfit. I probably will put on the outfit that I'm gonna wear to the party um, because, I mean, why not? Um, because now that I'm thinking about it, my appointment was supposed to be at the place, um, the birthday place at like 2.30. My appointment's at 1.45. Usually if you're getting a wax, especially a European wax, it only takes like 15 minutes. So 15 minutes, not 50, but 15 minutes. So I should be done with my wax by two o'clock, um, come home, uh, grab all the kids and then go. So I think I'm just gonna wear my outfit that I'm planning on wearing to the party to my appointment. So when I get back home, all I'm just doing is just helping my husband get the kids into the car. So that's pretty much it. So um, yeah, so I'm gonna relax for this next 30 minutes before I have to start getting ready myself. Um, but yeah, y'all, being a mom is a lot. <laughs> oh, it's so much, it's so much work, uh, honestly. Um, but so worth it, so rewarding. I know I'm gonna be extremely happy that I had kids when my kids are older and they're doing their own thing and like we're able to talk and communicate and just like, I don't know, be able to have like an adult relationship, you know? Right now we have like a parent and child relationship. So of course it's like a lot of reprimanding and punishing and then also like reinforcing and teaching. So it's like a lot of stuff, you know? So. Um, it's not, I really wouldn't consider this the fun part of parenting, honestly. I literally can't wait till they're adults. I think that's the fun part of parenting, honestly, is seeing, like, how your kids turn out. Like, that's awesome. So, um, but enjoying every season is the point. So, right now, I'm enjoying this whole season because they're so cute and seeing their personalities and then also seeing, like, all the things that they're learning and, and developing and stuff. So, that's the one thing I like about, like, the toddler newborn stage is, like, seeing them grow into themselves which is nice so that's what i'm gonna take as my little piece of joy for this season okay and they're so cute um but yeah so i'll chat with y'all later probably when i'm done getting ready i don't know if i'm gonna film me getting ready because i don't want this vlog to be too long honestly so you guys will probably see me when i'm like already um i might do like an outfit of the day i don't know who knows? I just don't want the vlog to be too long. But at the same time, let me know in the comments. Do you guys like long vlogs or short vlogs? Let me know, okay? Um, but yeah, so I might or might not vlog me getting ready. So I'll see you guys when I see y'all. <laughs> All right, y'all. So <laughs> um, we are already, um, we're headed to my wax appointment right now. Party. Uh, where did these niggas be at when they say they doing all this and all that? Tired of beef 
using you all you can't even pay me enough to react all right y'all so just finished getting my wax um honestly waxes are not that bad the first time i ever got a wax it hurt um it still hurts but it doesn't hurt as much um and honestly i wish i was one of those person people who get like the same person like when it comes to um getting my nails done or getting my hair done or getting my um my wax done i never get it done by the same person and my husband's always telling me like i need like a central person to go to like each time and honestly i don't i need to work on that so honestly some waxers are better than other waxers so um and that's all i have to say in that regard i mean she was really she wasn't she wasn't bad at all, at all or anything like that but she definitely didn't warn me <laughs> She was just like waxing and waxing and waxing and waxing, and I was like, okay, all right, let's get this out the way. Let's let's do this speedy fast. So, plus I kind of showed up late anyway, so probably she was just trying to make sure she was like on schedule and stuff. So, I totally understand that. But, but yeah. So now we are on the way to the birthday party venue, the place that we're holding the birthday party at. Um, Link is gonna drop us off, and then he's gonna go get the cake. And yeah. So yeah, we're probably gonna be there for at least like at least 30 minutes before the party starts, which is pretty good, honestly speaking. Versus being late. Because I remember for Micah's first birthday party, we were rushing. We were late. I think we came in like maybe 10 minutes before the party started or five minutes before the party started. So the fact that with two kids now, we're showing up to this party like 30, 40 minutes early is I wanna pat us on the back. Today we did good. Today we did good. But yeah, so um I'll see you guys when we're at the birthday place. Alright y'all, so we just made it. <laughs> we just made it to the birthday place. Well, I've actually been here for about 10-15 minutes. Um, Mike is out there with his older cousin in the inflatable area. And then here we got the birthday boy. And we're officially in the room. So I rented out like a little room. Look at that little chair, it's so cute. But anyway, so... I was telling Tony, I was like, I'm gonna start taking pictures of the baby because last time, as in last time, I mean like with my first child, I did not get a lot of pictures in his first birthday. Um, got him, and the, the craziest thing is for Micah's birthday, we dressed him up as like a pirate. And we have pictures of him with everybody but us. So this time I was like, we're gonna take pictures as a family, gonna take some cute pictures. So that's what we're planning on doing right now before a whole bunch of people start coming in and forming in. Um, and then right now, Malika is getting the cake. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys like the the, out, the venue and everything. So <sighs> pictures first, then venue, okay? Cause I'm making sure I'm getting these pictures in, okay? And look at this necklace, it's still so cute, y'all. One thing about me, I'm never getting a tattoo, but I will get a necklace, okay? Oh. Anyway. <laughs> Let me take these pictures. All right, y'all, so I got some pictures of him in this chair, and I got pictures of me and him in this chair. Look at how cute he is. Oh, he's so cute. I'm the birthday boy. I'm the birthday boy. I'm the birthday boy. Such a cutie, y'all. Such a cutie. <laughs> Gotta watch out for him because he's just gonna fall over. Look at how close he is to the edge. Okay, and so this is how the private room looks right now. And this is how it looks. Okay, so I realized that there's some really good party planners out there, okay? And eventually I'm gonna be able to hire one, y'all, because I hope by the time that my first turns five, I'll be making moolah, okay? So I can like afford like one of those per Kardashian level themed parties, okay? Um, maybe not Kardashian level, <laughs> maybe like Coco Jones, but either way, okay? I'll be trying, okay? Mark St. Martin, you know? 
But anyway, so, um, yeah. So far, this is what we're doing, just chilling. And now I'm gonna show you guys the venue. <sighs> All right, y'all, so this is a venue that I chose. It's called Snowy Fun. It's located in Little Elm, Texas, okay? You'll see it right there. You'll see my oldest right over here, trying to figure out where I'm going. Okay, okay, come on. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, I see. And then when you come in, this is how it looks. Yeah, what? What? Mikey, no. Go play, go play. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, I'm coming, I'm following. Let's go, let's go. And then you see like tables and chairs. They got like a snow room over here. Then the toddler area. Guys, look, look at the way I'm carrying my child. And then they got inflatables over there, over here, tell the area over there. But yeah, and then we got baby boy over here. I think I'm gonna let him go play in the toddler area. Let's go see if he likes it. Oh, it's a video. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> she <was a> no, <laughs> but we gotta take pictures. <laughs> okay, all right, y'all. So we just finished singing Happy Birthday. Uh, everybody ate, and everybody is back to jumping and all that kind of good stuff. Um, and yeah, and Deja and Deja are here. <laughs> and then we also have my cousin, my sister, and my uncle over there. Look at, look at Nene, always getting camera ready. Camera ready, Nene, all the time. Camera ready. <laughs> oh, I love that. <laughs> But yeah, so um, that's pretty much it. Um, I'll probably catch up with y'all when the party is over. But yeah, that's basically pretty much it. I might get some content of them like actually playing. So we'll see. A doggy and a dog They say I'm on the come up But I've been on the come down See me doing good They start to hate That's how it goes Now I don't know why they matter me Alright y'all, so I am going to end off the vlog here. The birthday party has been complete. Everyone is in the car. Everyone had a good time. Everyone ate some food. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, I know I said I was going to try and capture content of like the kids actually jumping and stuff. Honestly, I ended up just chilling and talking and vibing out. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. But um, I did try to show you guys the venue and all the things that I could have showed you guys. We did take some pictures. So I'm super happy about that. Um, but yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you guys would like to see more vlogs like this, then don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. And I'll see you guys in the next. Also, don't forget to follow me on all my social media networks, okay? 
all right because if you guys like this content you'll like the content i post on my other platforms okay but anyway see you guys in the next vlog bye For sunny shit to brighten up a winter so honest you the penny uh, pick it up like Chevy uh, new age Machiavelli uh, disagree don't tell me uh, now you in infinity we 98 trust that he be good on the ball like BB don't make no mistakes got the faith the 18 just not gonna be the same finna bleed down generations not gonna be in vain too young why you gotta go why you gotta go I just wanna know I just wanna know now too numb crying getting old crying getting old hope you free your soul hope you free your soul I might have caught the jewel